the rude, annoying, unfair comments from these crazy Dennis the Young fans keep coming through to my channel. This is the Rock and Roll Weatherman. My name is Sean Morrison. I wasn't going to address it. I mentioned it to Janaki. Hello. If he's in the background, of course, monitoring this page. Always does an excellent job. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. You know, it's annoying. First off, I do not live in a car. Mr. Morrison does not live in a fucking car. Mm -hmm. This freaking pepper jackass, what the fuck his name is. <laughs> you know, I can't even comment on um on, on something that's sticks related because these stalkers are out there. So I, I deleted my comment on another sticks page so his comment would erase. But that's besides the point. And on my channel, of course, comments are monitored. And these assholes' comments, 99% of the time, they will not go through. Sometimes they try to be friendly with some of these people to see, to have a friendly debate. But then they get stupid. And sometimes it's the same person keep doing it. It was like this Ed Ken, this Ed Kennedy jackass the other day. I don't know when, I don't know which guy he was before, but he just kept saying that all these Dennis the Young songs were better. What Styx is doing and the Made for Each Other song is a great Dennis the Young ballad and I was like I was like, please whatever. Wait, you think he signed in as somebody else? Yeah, he know. came in as Ed Kennedy. He had the account for like two days. So then I went and I went and checked I went and checked and I pressed delete. Delete delete. That's right. Then there's um then there was this guy, Daniel Gomez, who writes not who always write novels in the comments. Oh. I got rid of him once. Didn't realize he was there a second time. Got rid of him again. He showed up yesterday. Again. On the James Young video I did. Talking about, yeah, James Young's record should be reissued. And saying that is one thing, but making a 25-page paragraph about it is, is freaking insane. You know, he tried to he tried to say that it's good that I have competition with another... Um, or another guy that does videos. I don't. I don't want to say the guy's name because it's not. I'm not. Gonna, I'm not gonna sit here. I don't want to sit and give the guy attention. We know that he. He's not a six fan with, with Lawrence Gowan. You might know who he is, but I'm just gonna leave it like that. This is the bullshit every day that Mr. Morrison deals with. You know, you know, maybe he's the one of the very few people that has the balls to tell it like it is regarding sticks. On how right. Dennis Young is a dictator. Or. Can we say tyrant? Yes. Put the stuff in the past. You know, everything I, I say regarding Dennis Young is fact, not fiction. You know, every once in a while you guys can't take a joke when I said if he should, if he should host De Jeopardy or if he looked like an astronaut, a dentist, or a painter, or whatever. Come on, if you can't, if you don't know if that's a joke, come on. That's right. It's only good for him. Definitely. But, you know, his rec his 2060s Volume 1 didn't show in America. And looks like 2060's Volume 2 is not going to do much either, but just have to wait for the facts to come out before I can officially say anything on Volume 2. And Styx crashed the crowd, like I said. Didn't lie about it. You know, num number four on iTunes in the United States, Canada, number five, also in a couple of other countries. Excellent. Chart as well, excellent. The Young Hit number, I put a video up before, I think it was 37 or whatever, I don't remember the exact number. He was on, he, his album hit iTunes. That was the only thing so far he hit. He, he was on for like two days or something. Either way, you guys like, whoever likes 26 East Volume 2, fine. If you like it better than Sticks Crash the Crown, fine. To each their own. That's right. And what is Sticks doing right now? They, they're doing some dates with Collective Soul before they go out on their own. Right. And they're playing the, the crowded houses every night. Right now, what is Dennis the Young doing? For 26 East Volume 2, besides calling up, um, talking to different radio stations and doing interviews and probably putting half of them asleep and tell, telling his dumbass jokes, he's not even doing any live shows. His first live show is not going to be until November in Canada. And then I think, in the, yeah, and then in December, he, he's doing some, he has a date in, in beautiful Morristown, New Jersey. Hmm. Sounds like a place that Mr. Morrison goes to. <laughs> right, Janaki? Yeah, that's right. Oh, it's going to be fun dealing with Den the Dennis Young fans that night. Yeah, I'm ready to tell them off. 
you're not subscribed to the Sean Morrison YouTube channel, please do so. Everyone else out there that is subscribed, thank you very much for your continued love, honor, and support. It's greatly appreciated. I said I wasn't going to spend a good period of time here talking about this, but hey, I don't fucking care. It's... No, I know. It just every other fucking day with all this bullshit. I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Oh, stick sucks without Dennis. You know, the, the I don't think that at all. No. If they were hey, if they weren't doing something right, they wouldn't be, be around here twenty two years later with Lawrence Gowan still, would they be? Oh yeah. Plays you no know, ninety ninety nine nine tenths percent of their shows are sold out every time they play, so there you go. And that's that. So hopefully um these Dennis Young fans will stop making up new accounts to to send comments. Yeah, we see too much time on our hands. Yes, too much time on their hands they definitely have. Because once in a while if I'm loading a video and I, and I forget to moderate I forget to put the comments up for a review, somebody's will slip through and then Mr. Morrison is he's in the middle of something, comes back and he can find unwanted comments, then he has to delete them before you know any anybody sees any of this the stupidity that they post. The stupidity it is. That's right. Thank you everyone for listening to this video. There are some nice Dennis Young fans out Dennis Young fans out there. I'll give them that, but of course, yeah. but the, the majority ones that come to this channel to um post comments. They come to attack. They come to attack. They're a bunch they're a bunch of jackasses. So so go call a cab <laughs> and tell the cab driver your destination is to the Isle of Misanthrope. Yes. When you get there, then you can leave Mr. Morrison the fuck alone. Shame, shame, shame.